And now, your NORCAST weather update. Brought to you by Angelic Health Palliative and Hospice Care. Wherever you call home, Angelic Health will meet your needs with a customized care plan for patients with a chronic and or terminal illness. Visit angelic.health for more info. Good Sunday afternoon. Meteorologist Bobby Clark here with an update on your forecast. Everybody's gearing up for the game. Hope you enjoy it and help your team wins. Temperatures out there, we see, our, see ourselves mainly in the low to mid 50s across the area, despite the fact that we do have that cloud cover moving on in here and, and thickening up and could not rule out a shower or two popping up here and there. But overall, I think we'll be, most of us will stay dry and the south, the southwesterly flow will continue to have these temperatures well above normal for this time of year. We should be around 43 degrees, well, a good 10 degrees above normal currently at the moment. Dew points are creeping up just a bit. That's why I don't think it's going to be, uh, even though they are creeping up, I don't think it's going to be a major deluge if we get underneath one of these showers because it's just very, still on the drier side out there. But again, could possibly see a sprinkle or two or maybe a shower, but overall, looking at a major dry pattern of today, I think overnight tonight could see a little bit of a different story, especially in the southern part of the area. We'll talk about it right now. So again, some showers moving into the area itself, but overall not looking too bad out there. They quickly move on out as we head into this, the evening hours itself. And then overnight, uh, overnight tonight, we'll see a low pressure system that will develop off the Carolina coast. It's gonna move its way north and east. So it could clip us a little bit here in Cape May County and whatnot could see possibly maybe see some showers out there, maybe even steadier rain, but overall not looking too crazy out there. Most of us will miss it and not see anything out of this thing. And it moves out of here as we head into the afternoon hours tomorrow. Side, excuse me. We head into Tuesday, look like it will turn a little bit more chillier and windier. So, unfortunately, we'll see a taste of that chillier air across the area. So, for tomorrow, we'll see ourselves early showers. We'll end, we'll see maybe some sunshine by the afternoon temperatures. Again, above normal for this time of year. We'll see mainly in the 50s, even some upper 40s, with those possibly even with that sunshine popping out a few peaks by the time we hit the afternoon hours itself. As for Tuesday, as I mentioned, mostly cloudy could possibly, uh, well, I'm sorry, mostly cloudy on Tuesday with that wind coming in, making it feel that's much more chillier. Wednesday, again, we're watching a storm system move in here, clipper system, quick mover, not much moisture to work with, but could possibly give you some rain or possibly some snow showers. But as it goes past us, look what it does to our temperatures by the end of the week. 36 on Thursday, 29 on Friday. Wow, here comes old man winter coming back. Have a great afternoon, everybody. I'll see you later.